Should we try to reschedule? We are going to surprise Ty and Hallie. You wanna go to Texas with us? Cause we got all the time in the world For better or worse We should stay together So let's stay young and in love We should focus on us Forever Yeah baby if you are feeling like I do We could run away across the ocean Baby what you say We can leave today Anywhere we'll go we'll be alright It's all and happy Wednesday. So today, kids are in school, just a normal every day, but Marcos has the day off and we are gonna work on this front room. My couch is being delivered today. I'm super, super excited. We've got the rug options you guys have helped us with. I've got some new decor, things like that. So we're gonna take you along with us every step of the way. Super excited. What do you think? Okay, the couch that we've wait. No. Are you serious? Well, looks like there's a big smudge right here. Not happy about that. Right here. There and here. And here. Hopefully we just clean it out easily. I mean, it was in wrapping though, but like they must have been careless when they were wrapping it. I know, it's gonna be so nice. So pretty. And then I have all these fun pillows to put on it too. All right, starting the process guys. We're gonna put down, we're gonna roll this one up real quick and see what this one looks like. Unless we don't even wanna do that. What do you think? All of you guys said that you liked this one the best and then this one actually. So you guys helped us narrow it down. But now that the couch is here, I think the blue will be pretty. Did you find it? Comment below if you guys always lose remotes because we always do. Look, we found it. Yeah. But do we want to roll up the bottom one so I can return it? Yes. Do you don't want to even see the couch on it? We can. All right, I think we're saying goodbye to this one. I mean, it matches the house like perfect, but I think I want to add some color. What do you guys think? Yeah. What do you think, Hallie? It'll be like the blue one. Blue one? Blue. Blue is softer and no. I like that one, but this one, I just feel like it'll be a little bit too much gray, so. I think it would match perfect, like if we wanted it to be matchy matchy, but I think we're going for the blue. So let's, yeah. let's roll this up and then we'll, uh, I mean, do we want to put one piece on it just to see or are we good with the blue? Blue. Okay. It's seriously pretty though, either way. I think that would look good too, but we want some color. Yeah. laundry day by the way so I've got piles in my hallway but there's the rugs Marco's gonna load them in the car and they are going back today which I'm actually happy about because we got those three at RC Willie and the blue one at Target and the Target one was cheaper looks good so we actually have a bigger one coming today exact same rug so it's perfect timing but I say we put the couch on and see how it looks all right guys here's option number one we're still trying to figure it out Kids are going crazy. But I think we're gonna want the bigger rug, so more of it is shown. But we're trying to decide if we should put it at an angle kind of like this or center that middle piece with the wall. What do you think? I don't know. I know, it's hard. All right, so we kind of angled it so that this middle piece is centered with the corner now. And I got this lamp as well, which we'll show you guys later, that could hang over that middle piece in gold. I don't know. Not really loving the rug. So maybe the bigger one or we need to pull it out. Not loving the size of the rug. The size of the rug, yeah. All right, Marcos put together the new table for the loft. We'll have to show you guys the loft, the top piece is on now on the cabinets. 
and the bigger rug came. So this is how we have the couch now, but we kind of laid it where this big rug will be and it'll be to the wall. So we're gonna switch that out right now and see how we like it. All right guys, we got the new rug laid out. Marcos is actually steaming it. We saw this trick when we got this carpet in. There was a big line right there and they came back with the steamer and just steamed it out. So we're trying to do that with some of these ripples and then we'll lay the couch on. Marcus did this corner and it really helped it just like lay flat. So if you ever get a rug and it has ripples, two suggestions, lay it upside down for a little bit and then steam it. So I got all of these frames at Target. They were like 20 bucks each. So pretty cheap for a frame, can't speak today. And they're super light. So I printed out these pictures, like our family pictures that you guys see on our intro all the time. And we used to have these, this like collage where they're like smaller and different sizes. But since we have this huge wall right here, I thought it would look nice to put big ones all across above the couch. So I put those in and I'm just working on the rest of them. <laughs> all right, you guys, I had a little minute to sneak away where the kids couldn't hear me. Stella's in my bed watching a show. But I wanted to tell you about a huge, huge surprise trip that we have coming up on Friday. It is my birthday on Friday and so I wanted to go somewhere. I wanted to do something. My sister was like, hey, come to Texas. She found some super cheap flights. She let me know and I was like, let's do this. So we have it all planned out and we're leaving tomorrow. So sorry there was no vlog on Thursday, you guys. I know a lot of you were bummed. I was super bummed too, but we had to get all the kids caught up with school. We were finishing up that front room. I had to get laundry taken care of. I had to get the house cleaned, everything. So I just did not have time to sit down and edit a vlog. Cause for those of you that don't know, it takes about three to four hours and I just didn't have that time. But we have some super exciting vlogs coming up your way. We are going to Texas. I'm celebrating my birthday. We're gonna go to Six Flags. It's gonna be so fun. So we are gonna take you along with us every step of the way. So we will be doing that in our next vlog, but I just wanted to fill you guys in, get you excited. Again, I'm sorry we didn't post on Thursday. We usually post every Tuesday, Thursday. It just, there wasn't enough time. So you may be wondering, okay, are you taking all of your kids to Six Flags? What's going on there, right? <laughs> and see what they were because if you guys know us we love to do surprises we love to kind of surprise the kids and have some fun things going on in life so um, I want to make sure that they were all in class so here's the plan so because we're gonna go to Six Flags we are going to surprise Ty and Hallie they have no idea that they're gonna come with us to Texas I have an amazing cousin that is married no kids she is so great with my kids I offered to pay her to come down and watch the two littles so that we could fly out on Thursday, Thursday night, and have so much fun on my birthday for Friday and go to Six Flags on Saturday. So we will catch the kids' reaction when I tell them, so stay tuned. Taking a little lunch break, guys, giving a little break for the decorating, but I wanted to show you how the loft turned out upstairs. Um, if you watched our last vlog, we put some cabinets in and the top piece was not on. So I wanted to show you that real quick. Ta-da! So it looks a lot like downstairs. So this wood piece wasn't on last time. So we're loving these deep cabinets um, to put all the toys in and everything. It's been so great. So there's that little update. All right, guys, here's an option. We really like having it at an angle so it opens up. If you're sitting there, you can, it just opens up the room. It doesn't close it off, but I don't know. It's like too much rug right here. So comment below. Do you like the couch at an angle or do you think we should, we're gonna move it now and center it like on the wall too? All right guys, this is centered on the rug, centered on the wall. So comment below. Do you like it more in an angle or do you like it centered on the rug? We need your guys' help. So this is the view from the front door, which I feel like looks good. I did find a little round table on Amazon that I might put right there, like a coffee table. That would look pretty. All right, guys, I don't think I bought enough pillows. Ha <laughs> <laughs> I know, but I just didn't know what colors to do. We had never actually seen the couch, you guys. This is a special order, so I never even saw the actual color in real life. So I just grabbed a bunch to see. So we're gonna try out some different options, but it's looking really good. Might actually put the clock right there, and then all the pictures right here. We'll see. All right, guys, this apparently is the winning combo. So it really ties in 
all the colors. So we went with a matching on each side instead of like randoms. Kind of got outvoted, but anyway, I got this at Target, this at Kohl's, this at Home Goods, Target. Debating on keeping this middle one or not. Marcus is almost done with the lamp. And we'll put up the pictures. Kind of like the middle one though. Comment below if you like it with or without. Starting to feel homey, guys. I think we're gonna move this plant, do the pictures, and probably not the clock, but we'll see. I like that. What do you think? I do. Yeah, ties in the gold right here, and the frames all have gold on them, so these will look good. All right, guys, starting to put up the frames. We've got the lamp in the corner, loving the pillows, and we actually had to get rid of two pictures because we want the lamp to stay in the corner. We might have to move it over a little bit. I don't know, we, we're still working, but so far so good. Really liking it. Two family picks, four kids on the side. So here we go. All right, you guys, final reveal. Looks so good. So now we're just dealing with this spot and we're trying to decide if we should put a clock right there or get like a tall, like tiered shelf thing. Comment below, clock right there or leave it blank but then I feel like it's heavy on this side and it just needs something. Comment below if we should move anything around because I think that'll look good, but we're done for tonight, time for dinner. Right, you guys so that is the final reveal I love how everything turned out it all came together but here's my next question for you guys do we put a round coffee table right there I found one on Amazon that's gold and white do I put that there or do we leave it open so comment below let us know if you think we should add a table or leave it open but give this video a thumbs up thanks so much for watching don't forget to subscribe and we'll see you guys next time bye Hey guys, and happy Thursday. Today is the day we are headed out of town. We are headed to Texas. It's gonna be so much fun. We have so many fun plans. Tomorrow is my birthday. We're gonna celebrate that. We're gonna take you guys along with us, and we'll also be heading to Six Flags all day Saturday. So like I said, we're taking Ty and Hallie with us. We're gonna surprise Ty and Hallie and kinda tell them a little bit later today that we're going to Texas. So we'll take you along with us for that reaction, getting so excited, getting packed up, and getting ready to head out. We fly out at six, so we'll probably leave here around four, and so we'll just take you along with us for the whole day. All right guys, so some interesting news. I actually just got an email literally like 10 minutes ago um, from my flight saying, that it could be delayed due to weather. Anyway, five minutes later, I got another email from Six Flags saying that they're closing the park on Saturday. So, kind of crazy, kind of last minute plans. I was trying to get the house clean for my cousin Carly. I was trying to pack. School's still going on. I've gotten a tons of messages from Ty's teacher because he's behind on assignments, trying to deal with that. It's just been a super crazy morning. So I got online to check the flight status. It says it's still on time, but it was just giving us warnings that due to weather. I text my sister Cassie, who's in Texas, and she said, yeah, there's a hundred car crash on the freeway. Several people died due to ice. So I don't know if I told you guys, but it's supposed to be an all time low in Texas this weekend. And Texas's weather is similar to Vegas. It's very warm in the winters. It doesn't snow. And so I was thinking Six Flags in the winter, it's gonna be great. They had a special deal on tickets, super cheap, and just thought it would be a fun time. But the high on Saturday, the high was gonna be 28 degrees. So I'm packing my coats, my beanies, my mittens, my Ugg boots, all the things. And I guess, I don't know now, like I'm torn on what I'm supposed to do. I don't want our flight to be delayed. We're already getting in super late. We're supposed to land at 11.15. I don't want my sister to have to come get us even later. It already sucks that we can't go to Six Flags. I know the kids are gonna be so excited about that. And that's a big reason why um, we decided to bring them because we thought they would enjoy that. So now I'm on the fence trying to figure out what I should do. 
should we try to reschedule, try to go back to Six Flags another time? I don't know, there's just all these plans and I just don't know what to do, so I'm just trying to figure it all out. All right, I talked to my sister and I'm like, what would you do? You know, we had some reservations. Her and I had plans for tomorrow for my birthday. I found out that Six Flags is only gonna give us one month to use that credit for the tickets. They're not gonna give any refunds and I have one month. So I'm looking at our calendar, trying to figure out when we can go next. And it's not looking good, guys. Marco's got some stuff with work going on. In-laws coming in the end of the month, so that wouldn't work. So the only available time is next weekend. So I'm trying to think of ways to make this work. And I'm thinking Callie and I could fly out Thursday and then Marcos could join us Friday night. My parents could still come down and watch the girls. Just got off the phone with Marcos and he said that could work. So now I have to try to find flights for Thursday night for me and Hallie and Marcos join us Friday. And Ty would be joining Marcos Friday as well because he's got school. He's super behind on his assignments. He's kind of not been keeping up with things, so he's not gonna be able to go with us early. So I still haven't told the kids though. All right guys, fast forward a couple hours. I'm here on the computer trying to search all the flights. I am trying to debate whether I should cancel the flight or we should just go. I keep going back and forth. It's just been quite a day guys, and I'm just giving you little snippets here and there, but it looks like the credit, so they don't give you a refund through the airlines, at least American Airlines, so they're giving us a credit. So I'm waiting for that confirmation number to schedule a new flight, and I don't wanna pay a lot more because that's another reason we went, it's because the flights were super cheap. Anyway, all said and done, I just canceled the flight, which was super easy, I'm grateful for that. And tonight we are gonna book some flights. Um, like I said, Hallie and I will leave Thursday night, Marcos has to work all day Friday. He'll join us later Friday night and then we can go to Six Flags all day Saturday. So that'll be fun and then spend all day Sunday with my sister too. So super grateful to my parents for offering to come kind of last minute and grab the girls. They're so excited to spend time with grandma and grandpa. They are beyond excited. So now all I have left to do is, is tell the kids. We still haven't told them and I'm glad I didn't tell them because I'm glad I didn't tell them till last minute because they would have been super disappointed. So. I'm gonna tell Hallie first, cause Ty's actually at piano. So I'm gonna tell Hallie and see her reaction. All right, Marcos is home. We're trying to figure out a plan B. Hallie, what do you think? I like your outfit. All the girls are matching today. I'll we'll have to show you guys. You like it? Yeah. Do you wanna go to Texas with us? Yeah. Do you? Are you sure? Yeah. Next week? We're gonna go today. <laughs> you wanna go see Reese? That'd be fun. Yeah. Allie, <laughs> your face. Okay, here's the deal though. Mm -hmm. We're going to Six Flags and we're gonna ride all the rides. So you, if you come with us, you have to go on the rides with us. Six Flags? Mm -hmm. Reese I is gonna come to um, roller coasters. So you gotta try oh, all of them. Oh yeah! Yeah, they're fun big ones. And you're tall enough now, and Reese is gonna go on the one she can. So if you come, you have to go on the rides with us. I know, what a punishment, right? Because we're just taking you. Oh. Maybe. We'll see. Like Me and Dad were supposed to go tonight, and we were gonna surprise you and take you with us tonight. Yeah, we were gonna say, okay, Hallie, let's go pack your bag, and let's go. And then I'll be like, wait. What? Are you surprised or did you know? Yeah, I, I just was like, I'm excited. Okay, so I was thinking, since we had to rearrange our whole trip, Marcos has to work next Friday. So he can't join us until later Friday night. I was thinking you and I could go a day early and hang out with Cassie and Reese, just the two of us, the girls. That'd be fun? Yeah. You excited? Mm-hmm. And you're going to go on all the rides with us? Mm-hmm. Are you sure? No. I'll believe it when I see it. I'm excited to go, and Reese is so excited to see you. Mm. That'll be fun, huh? Yeah. Did you know, Hallie, that we were going to take you? No, 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 I did not. Why would she? She doesn't seem very surprised. She's shocked. Remember, <laughs> she did this with Disneyland <laughs> last year. Yeah, she gets more like speechless instead yeah, of like a reaction. Like, like, oh my, oh, and then I'm like. Is it a good shock, though? Yes, it's a good shock. Right? 
It'll be so fun, huh? Oh, it's happening. Oh, it's happening. Every time you say you don't want to go on a ride, like at Disneyland and Calbunga Bay and even just barely at Great Wolf, you were like, I'm scared. I don't want to go. And then what do you say? Can we go again? Can we do it again? Okay, so I know that you, it might be scary and I might be scared, but it'll be fun. Okay? How's school? Well, pretty good so far. We only have to do Valentine's things and nothing's for a grade today. So I don't even have to go to class. Did you, you finish all those assignments that your teacher messaged me that you were missing? Mm -hmm. There was like 10. I have a surprise for you. Mm -hmm. You probably already know because you overheard and you're always around. So we're going to take you to Texas tonight, which Ty overheard us, so I missed the reaction. Um, but it's not going to happen anymore due to weather. So if you can get all your assignments up, if you can get your grades up in the next week and get caught up, you can come with dad on Friday night. Are you excited? Yeah. One thing you have to do though, if you come, and I told Hallie this, you have to go on all the rides at Six Flags because we're going to Six Flags. I have been waiting for this day forever. <laughs> Yeah, I knew Ty would want to go to Six Flags, so hopefully it's open. We were going to go. That's a big reason we didn't go. So we'll be going to Six Flags all day on Saturday. Yes, I've been waiting for this day forever.